Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Now in today's, I'm going to attempt Stephen Hendry's Tough Table Challenge. Lots of people have asked me to attempt this challenge. Now, I'd definitely say it does look difficult. You've got these balls by the side cushions. Um, I've seen on Stephen's channel that a couple of pros have attempted this now. So Mark Williams has had a go and Judd Trump has had a go. Both times those guys had two attempts at doing it. So I'm going to do the same. I'm going to give myself two attempts. I haven't tried this yet. I don't know how I'm going to approach it. But I think it's better if you just have that, those two goes. It's more realistic than trying it 20 times and just seeing what your highest break can be. So let's get into the video and have a go. Right, so I'm going to set myself up with this first red here. I'm going to try and leave an angle, I think, on the black and go into these three reds straight away. So let's do that. So let's run it through, leave a little angle, and then I can go into these three reds. So it'd be good if I could even flick the, the furthest one away. So it's OK, not too bad. So at least now I've got that other red into open play. And I've landed nicely on this one to the middle. Have they landed as a plant? So actually, I'm very tempted to play this plant that's landed here. Let's give it a go. So I've got to squeeze it the other way in order to make it work. Yeah, that was nice. It was on. <laughs> and I've actually pushed another red just a little bit safer again. So I need a good pot on the black. Just unplast this other red. Yep, so that was quite nice there. So that's 16. So I'm nicely on this red. Let's see if this one goes here past the other one. Probably does just about. It's risky to take that at this point, so I'm not going to. So I'm going to go down for the black and probably play the two that are on that black cushion now. So yeah, 17. So a little bit of a stun down. So I think I've just about got a nice angle on this, this red here. So that's 24. So stun out here, just make sure I get a good angle on the black. Yeah, that's nice. So I may even now play for this tough one over here. I think I'm gonna try and get on that, get a tough one out of the way. land on it nicely if I can. Yeah, that's good. 32, I think. So a little stun out and then I can play to this one. So I want to bring the white back just a fraction. Don't want to double hit here. Yep, so I've got a nice angle now to get onto that other red. So a little holding shot. Yep, nice bounce off the cushion. It's always good. I think that's, so what have we got? Three, five, yeah, 40, yeah. So let's give it a go. So this one here, stunning out for the black. Yeah, it's nice. 41. So I'm probably gonna play now, let's have a look. Yeah, bottom and reverse side, try and get up to this red here. Let's give it a go. So bottom and reverse side. Bit of side. Yeah, a little bit on there, yeah. So 48. So I'm going to pop this one now. Little stun up for bulk colour. So I've got to get hold of this nicely. Just okay, actually, because it's Canon the green, so 49. So I can probably, I think I'm going to send the white down here now for these, into these, this area for those three, so 49. I'll give it a go. Little Canon would be good. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, we'll take that. So... That's uh, 53, isn't it? Yeah. So that one's just a bit more angle than I would like. Let's get rid of this, this difficult one. Uh, so I think i yeah got to go and run and get my extension. So I'll just run over here because I've put my cue case out the way. 
I've got my extension here. So 53, aren't we yet? So let's try and play it positively and get the white on and off the cushion. 53. Yeah, 54. Extension down here. Oh, so it's a bit of a shame there that I've landed really straight. So I'm going to try and play a really good screw shot here and try and, even if I nudge the red, I might develop it. So, 54. And then if I miss it, yeah, that's not too bad. So, 61. So I've got to float this in. I'm going to play for the pink, I think. So, 61. Yeah, just about 62. Now, yeah, I'm running out of reds as options now. So it might even be worth taking the blue and get to this red here, so 62. So, nice blue there, 67, so a little stun out and then I can get to those reds up there. So, 68, nice angle on the brown to get to this one, so let's try it. Need a bit of a bounce. Yeah, that's okay. 72. So, yeah, I can get the white out. Let's give it a go. Yeah, it's nice. 73. So, now let's get to one of these tricky ones. want to be too straight and I am so 76 oh, that's a bit of a shame so what can we do that one's too thin so I've got to try and force an angle off this one uh, yeah let's try and force it around the corner it's like a stun run through yeah, Q even came off my hand there because I was really forcing it. So, 77. So, I only want to bring this back a touch and then I've got a nice angle on this red there. So, yeah. 79. So we've only got these horrible ones now, so I've got to try and pop this, leave myself on a bulk colour, I think. So I'll try and get the white out. Oh, I've lost the white a bit there. So 80, still pretty happy with that though. So what should we do? Let's have a look. So both reds are tough. Yeah, it's not nice. It almost looks like there's an angle on the blue to even move that red there. I might even be brave and try and do that. And if I don't hit the red, I'm going to try and land in behind it. So let's try that. So try and drop the blue in. Oh, just missed it. So not bad actually there. Pretty happy with that. I think I'm even going to leave that as my, my attempt there. Um, I got down to the last two reds. Um, I could have another go, but yeah, it's very difficult. Um, yeah, really enjoyed that actually, having a go at the, the tough table challenge there. Didn't know what to expect. It's worth saying actually that when you're watching these professionals play, they're playing on pockets that are tighter than this table. These pockets are a little bit easier. So the ones down the cushion for me, they're just a little bit more forgiving. But 
Yeah, that'd be great if people uh, have a go at that challenge, just like Stephen Hendry has said on uh, his channel. Um, it'd be good to see some other attempts of people trying the, the tough table challenge. It doesn't matter what your break is, even if for you, you can get quite a good break. Uh, you're just trying to always beat your own personal best. So thanks a lot for watching, everybody. I hope everybody has a fantastic Christmas and a fantastic New Year, and good luck with all your snooker goals. Please continue to support the channel. Subscribe if you're new and you haven't already. And remember to give this video a like. And if anyone's interested in any personal one-to-one -one coaching sessions, remember I'm working on this very table, helping players to improve their game all the time. So get in touch and I'd love to help you with your game. Have a great Christmas, everybody. I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.